guys, join me as I take my Too Faced Mary Mary makeup palette for a test run and create a Christmas inspired makeup look. Let's dive in. Okay, switching over to voiceover. So starting off by prepping and priming my face with a Tame Title concealer and foundation. Then moving on to priming my eyes with Halsey's brand About Face. Okay, going in with the palette now, but first a sniff test. Applying the shade trimmings all over the lid as a foundational base shade. Okay, now going in with this beautiful forest green shade balsam and concentrating that on the outer edges to create a smoked out green eye look. Okay, there are so many pretty shimmery shades in here, so I'm going in with Winter Wonderland, and they also have a chromatic effect to them. But I do have to say, I wish they were a little bit more pigmented, but I did hear somewhere that they are meant to be more like a topper rather than its own standalone shade. So another shimmer shade I'm going to pack on is Tannin Bomb. Again, it has kind of a chromatic, holographic look to it. Just wish it was a little bit more pigmented. Okay, now dipping into balsam and applying it to a lower lash line as well, just to create congruency. Okay, so this is a neat trick I mentioned in a previous video, but I like to take my Fenty Beauty highlighter and use it as shadow, and just use it to highlight my inner corners and my brow bone. Okay, now lining my eyes with my Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Lining Pen, and as I mentioned, I like to draw an extended green. I think it just looks more flattering with my eye shape as opposed to drawing it at an upward angle. So totally optional, but I do like to take my Urban Decay 24-7 liner and stash, and I like to trace over the liner to soften up the look. So I'm going to be using the built-in blush of Candyland, and I actually really like it. I think it gives me this nice rosy flush. Okay guys, this is when I realized I kind of did things out of order, but I forgot to curl my lashes and apply mascara, so I'm doing that right now. This is a Shiseido eyelash curler. And here I'm using the Lancome Hypnostrama Waterproof Mascara. Okay, now I'm back on track. So I'm also going to be using the built-in highlighter. It's called Making Spirits Bright. And actually, I rather like how everything looks. It definitely gives me this rosy, dewy glow. And now onto the lips. This is my favorite duo at the moment. My Urban Decay Vice Lipstick in the color 1993. And then I put the Lancome Lay Absolute Lip Gloss over it for a chocolate glossy lip. Okay, so this is the finished look. Um, I did change into a party ready outfit. The earrings and the top are both from Loft. I think they're super cute. Just some final thoughts about this palette is I am disappointed with the shimmers. Like for example, Tannin Bombs and Winter Wonderland. It did come out pretty shimmery, but it could have been way more pigmented and buildable. So those are a little bit disappointing. I do like, however, the blush and the highlighter, which I saw some negative feedback about. I think it actually gives me this nice like rosy glow. So I actually like both of those. But other than that, um, yeah, I guess I, I do like how convenient it is. It has everything all in one, but the shimmers are disappointing. But anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful holiday.